Purple isn't your best color, sister. Hmm. How about yellow? So I don't subscribe to the fashion thought process that people have certain colors that look best on them. Maybe that's because <laughs> I feel like all the colors look good on me. <laughs> or at least that's what I tell myself. I hate people to tell me I can't do something because then I'm really gonna do it. Now you're gonna see me in a whole lot of freaking purple. As a matter of fact, it is the main color in my logo and all of my costumes for Hope with Halloween weekend, the women's festival I'm hosting are predominantly like, like purple. It's a shame it's not my color. <laughs> I'm gonna tell you why I chose it for my Logo. 17 years ago, when my first daughter died at birth, I'm sitting in labor and delivery room on a hall with lots of other women giving birth to live babies, and I'm going to be giving birth to a deceased baby. So the nurses were so kind, and they put this leaf, uh, this purple card and leaf on my door so that people would know that I was grieving. And not come in like congratulating me. And then they gave me this beautiful purple box with her footprints and hair and I have her cremated cremated remains and everything in here. So purple has been a special color for me that represents to me the most amount of pain I've ever been in in my life, but also how far I've come from it and why I value having hope so much. I know that that was a very deep answer for a kind of a shallow statement, but you never know what you're gonna get from me. <laughs> That's how I roll. I love purple and all the colors, honestly. I just keep telling myself there's nothing I can't wear and I don't listen to what other people say, so therefore I'm happy. 